we're going to talk about comments. So basically, uh, comments have two main uses. The first use is to disable like um, a section in your code. For example, if I wanted to disable um, this line seven, I could use a comment. And also, a comment is used for writing like little descriptions in your code that explain what um, a, a particular place in your code does. So in order to explain this properly, if I wanted to uh, comment this line right here, uh, line six, you can first create two forward slashes. This is the first way of creating a comment in C. So I can say um, in line six, I am creating a variable, a variable named um, age and it stores my age. So basically this is just um, a simple way of writing a comment. And anytime you run your code, whatever line that is commented out, that is whatever line that is commented will not run. So if I wanted to disable line eight right now, I will just put two forward slashes in front of it. And then line eight is going to be disabled. So if I, if I run this right now, you see that nothing happens because line eight has been disabled. That is the print F. But if I uncomment it, I run this. You can see it prints out I am nine years old. Now there is also another way of creating comments. Uh, the other way to create a comment is you type a forward slash and then an asterisk. So uh, if you are not using Visual Studio Code, this might not be auto completed for you. But if you want to create a comment uh, using this method, just type in a forward slash two asterisks and a trailing false forward slash. So inside these two asterisks, you can now write um, whatever you want. Like the line 12 is responsible and blah, blah, blah. So you could just write whatever you wanted between these two asterisks. So the main uses for comments is they help to like write descriptions in your code. So that even when you come back to your code like three months later and you read the description, you can understand, okay, this particular line does this, this particular line does this. And then they also help us to um, kind of temporarily disable a particular line in your code. So let's say you do not want that line to function. You could just put a forward slash. And then when the C language, um, when the computer is running your program, it's going to completely ignore that line so whatever line that is commented is going to be ignored so those are the two main again those are the two main functions of um of comments they help us document our code that is give descriptions of what like um of what like a line or a section of your code is doing and it is generally recommended to always document your code because if you are working in like a company for example you might be working with other uh, people and then you would want to write code in such a way that when other people look at it, they understand what you had written. So you can leave in comments that describe what like a line does or a comment that describes what a chunk of code does so that when you, like your coworker is reading it, the person will understand exactly what you wrote. So that is all for this video. We talked about comments. Thank you for watching this video and I will see you in the next video.